Raghav and welcome to this episode of Ask Raghav. These days I am getting several questions on the hiring process, on the interview process. I get questions about uh, I have got some of my rounds cleared but I have still not got any specific reply from the company, from the HR. There are cases where uh, people have given the interview and have given all the rounds and it has been 2-3 weeks and they are still waiting for a call or a response from HR. One of these questions I got from uh, this question is from Shiv and he says uh, please tell me when the star, when will start hiring for software testing. Actually recently 5-6 managerial rounds are cleared but did not get any response from the HR side. So similarly there are some other questions. So today I am going to discuss these cases that when you have given some rounds and you are still waiting for a final reply what should you do should you wait should you check back with the HR should you call the company and check what is the status so uh, let's say one of the cases can be the company may still be considering other candidates and this process can take some time and you can do a very clear communication with the HR team that how much time will it take uh, after how many days should I check back or should I just wait for your call so if there is some definite communication with the HR team, if they have given some specific timelines, you can always check with the HR team. You can send an email or if you are allowed to call them, you can do that and you can check with them. The other case can be, there can be some miscommunication and the HR is waiting for you. So in that case, make sure that you check your emails regularly, whatever email ID you have provided to the HR team. It can also be, it is also okay if you want to call them or check them that what is the update. It can be the case that they are waiting for you. The other case can be the company has already selected another candidate. Now in this case as well, you should check with the HR. You can send an email and based on whatever you believe is the right time. Uh, it if it has been a week after all your rounds are done or two weeks, it can be a good time after a week or so you can check with the HR team. Now uh, here I have written that it will be a good idea to send a follow-up email after two three weeks but you should uh, go as per the scenario if you believe there is uh, it is not a mass hiring and the position is just for one or two people it is good that you check within a week or so so you can check with the HR team and you can check with the company. Now whenever you go to a interview process you go through a hiring process there will be some communication with the HR or you can from your end you can inform them or you can check with them what is the process how many rounds are there after how many rounds or after what round will I get a definite answer after this particular round after how much time should I check back so if you have that kind of communication with the HR you can mention that in your email that as per our communication this is what we had communicated or this is what we understand and this is why I am sending you the email. Now you can send an uh, email something like uh, you can uh, address them dear whatever is the name of the HR. I hope this email finds you well. I am writing to follow up on my recent managerial round interview or whatever uh, interview technical managerial round HR round whatever it is for the position of this particular position and you can inform that uh, you know I would appreciate if if you are still if you could update me on the hiring process are you still considering me for the position and if so when can I expect to hear back from you and this is a kind of a, a guideline for you you can change it as according to whatever is your role whatever is the job you are uh, going for whatever communication you had with the HR and if there is some specific timeline they had mentioned you can mention that as we discussed as you inform that we have to check after this particular time so I'm checking for any updates so it is always good that you do a communication whenever you have a doubt it is okay to do a communication if you cannot call or do a direct call or message it is always okay to send a professional email and check if you do not get any reply then it may be obvious that they have considered some other candidate otherwise most of the cases you will get a reply whatever is the result you will they will mention it so this is how you can uh, you know release your doubts don't just stay in doubt always do communication and check out what are the things happening what are the updates so I hope this was helpful 
if you have any other questions for me for the next episode of ask raghav you can let me know in the comment section and i will see you soon thank you for watching and never stop learning